Don't what? Don't film me. I'm not filming you. What are you doing? <laughs> hey! <laughs> that was perfect. That's perfect. You're fired. That was like shooting in the dark. <laughs> All right, this is my first attempt. Sorry, my hair is a mess. Not very good for my first attempt. I'll have my hair done when I turn this camera back on. But this is this is my first attempt at uh, doing, I guess, our our new YouTube channel thing. We're gonna make an attempt. The whole idea behind, uh, I guess, our YouTube channel is we're just we're gonna get married soon so the whole idea behind the youtube channel is just to have fun laugh at me it's <laughs> just it's just about too. fun and, and life and enjoying life and adventures and it's gonna be awesome so what are we doing today i don't know let's go to the tracy aviary where do you want to go to the tracy aviary what's that it's where the birds and the butterflies are the birds and the beasts. <laughs> the birds and the beasts? Beasts. Look at there's my dirty laundry. Anyhow, we're going to the Tracy Aviary, so it'll be awesome. Why are we listening to this? Oh, yeah! It goes <laughs> on! It was called Summer Hits of the 80s. I should probably put on my seatbelt. Yes, we are headed to. There's a video of you breaking the law. Le Tracy Aviary. This is going to be fun. Actually, one of our friends was saying, should we go to the Holly Co Color Festival this year, or should we go to the Chocolate and Cheese Festival? I think we should go to both. You can, in, both in one day? No. Saturday that, Sunday this. Could do that. Then we can fill both. I just want chocolate and cheese. Anyhow. Oh, yeah. No, it'll be good. Yeah, All right. Long So I think the chocolate and cheese festival is where it's at. That's the one we need to... You're going to have to learn how to edit this stuff. You're going to have to learn to edit this stuff. <laughs> We're new. All right. Here we are. We're at the world-famous Tracy's Aviary. Apparently this is owned by Tracy. <laughs> Anyhow, so we're about to go in and look at some uh, pretty awesome birds. Um, and... Uh, I've got Ken's here, mm -hmm. so this should be a very interesting excursion with I've never with been. Tracy's Aviary. It's Tracy Aviary in in uh, what was it, Liberty Park? Yeah, Liberty Park. It's gonna be awesome. Let's go in and check it out. Oh, hey. So. How's it going? It's good. Good. So we're now officially inside Tracy's Aviary. Ducks. In Nothing there are ducks. Yet. It's just ducks. Nothing spectacular. But these ducks dive. They see. dive, see? Watch, they're gonna come up. See, you can see his water bubbles. Diving. Ah. Okay. We're gonna go see the king of the Andes. Ooh, he's a vulture. National symbol of six countries. National treasure at Tracy's Aviary. Tracy Aviary. Where is he? Whoa. You know what it reminds me of? You know what it reminds me of? Somebody's gonna kill you. I see the birds in the uh, jungle book. What do you wanna do? Look at his eyes. I, I don't know. There's no What do you want to do? Happiness in those eyes. I don't know. That's what do you want to do? Oh, they're going to eat that. Look at this. He's got his wings out. Are these ibis? They got the pelicans. <laughs> This one's got like, what is on their, their beaks? That's like, just their little um, horn. Is that what attracts fish? I don't know. It's kind of cool. Look how pretty that is. People, Indians could use them. <laughs> okay, what are we looking at? We're looking at some golden eagles. They're not as cool as your actual ones. Cause they, don't they are actual way. ones. What do you mean they're not as wild. cool as actual? Oh, wild. Yeah, chances are these guys are poor little guys that got caught in power lines or hit by a car. Or they look a lot they're, 
they're they're still real eagles they're just out of commission that's why they're in an enclosure like this they can't really get up and fly out but that doesn't ruin their 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 majestic we got spider bird just hanging upside down spider we got another spider bird looks like it's a little competition Look at his Look at his face. Look at this watch. It's like, my Jew, I think I've got it. <laughs> oh, indubitably. Oh. What are you doing? What is this contraption that you hold in your That's hands? Uh, yeah. I wonder if... That'd be cool if birds had, like, accents like that. They're like, ah, the what is this? It's like, what is this man like, doing? He's gonna eat this mouse. Oh, yeah. there we go. Yeah, you got your mouse. Why is it that flamingos stand on one foot? Can you answer this age-old mystery? Because they, they migrate, but they'll be coming back shortly. They're so big. Golden eagles and the bald eagles over on exhibit can't fly oh, at all. Yeah. So, They're the ones that have probably got hit by a car or got shot. hit, yeah, yeah shot at. Oh, wow, know. okay. Yeah. So we're walking around here at the Tracy Aviary and I noticed this. Some gardener just like, I quit. So apparently the Amazon Adventure, these guys reserved it for a birthday party, but I guess you can reserve it for birthday parties. So they've got like, they've got these tropical birds in here that you can feed. I'm guessing it's more like a nectar or something in a cup. Okay, come here. Pretty cool, but I guess that's how they make a little extra money. Is you gotta, you actually gotta pay to reserve to come in and do it. They'll like land on your arm and eat the nectar and stuff. I think they do this at like the San Diego Zoo and many other zoos and stuff. It's pretty cool. Oh, boom! There we go. He'll eat them. Keep your hand out. When he starts chewing your fingertips, that's when you need to be concerned. Right? Yeah. So we're sitting here and we're feeding the ducks. Love we notice pogo some stick. poor kid left his pogo stick. So we are about to watch an obese person pogo stick inside of a bird park. <laughs> Don't die. Alright, so there were some cool people that were like juggling and stuff and we were like, hey, can we film you? And they're like, no. And I was like, oh, okay. You gotta shut down. Like, we were like willing to like show how cool they were and like their cool juggling skills and they're like, no, we don't Not do the that. World will never know. So, but over here I'm hearing some cool like drums and stuff. So I'm gonna around. see if they'll let me film them. So, cool. Alright. Alright everybody, introduce your name. What's your name? Jeremy. Jeremy. Josh. Josh. She. Chi? That's cool, man. <laughs> I'm digging the hair. It looks really cool. Andy. Andy. And you guys are? We're Slap. 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 Salt Lake Alternative. Uh, my voice cracked. Can, you, can we start over? Yeah, that was a fine. Go ahead. It's cool. It's cool. Can you guys hear that? Salt Lake Alternative Percussion. <laughs> <laughs> that was embarrassing. Okay. We're about to eat at Yi Sushi Bistro. Kung Pao chicken and sushi. This is gonna be really good. It looks pretty tasty. How is it? So we are going to go see a movie at the Larry H. Miller Megapex. Okay. Here goes pet peeve time. 
okay? There's nothing I hate more than going in to go use a public restroom and you sit down to do your business and then you pull up your pants and your pant leg is wet because some knucklehead or some stupid little kid thinks it's okay to piss all over the floor. If you are a parent and your kid pisses on the floor, do the right thing and find somebody that works there and get it cleaned up. That's the right thing to do. Instead of just walk away from it. It's very frustrating to sit there and have your pant leg soaked in piss. Okay? That just happened to me. Now I have to sit through a movie that we just paid for with a piss-soaked pant leg. Alright, so... We're over at Ken's mom's place and... The dog just ate his third stick of lipstick. She got red all over her. She got red all over her fur? Yeah. <laughs> how, how many, how many? She comes in and it looks like she's bruised because she'll have like a red dot and then it slowly gets Let's like see. lighter. Is the, is the evidence still there? No, I put it up there. Oh, where is it? Yeah, I'll show you. That's right there. She the dog. Lips. Every time. She loves lipstick and it's disgusting. She licks her chops. All right, so. Uh, how was the movie? It was kind of meh. It was kind of meh. You loved it. So. I thought it was funny. But anyhow, uh, I think we're done filming our first, Time to change. hopefully of many, uh, first of hopefully many video blogs, and uh, it's okay. I got it. You're not showing your face. That's okay. Nobody wants to see my face. You're showing your chin. So. This will be the first of many video blogs, and uh, it was great. So, tomorrow, what are we doing tomorrow? We're not doing a video tomorrow. We're not doing a video tomorrow. We're, We're doing, doing it next week. We're doing one next week. It's going to be awesome. So, next week is the haunted house. Ooh. Yeah. For those of you that don't know, um, I've got a surprise for you for next week. I am the general manager of a haunted attraction of Castle of Chaos in Salt Lake City, Utah. So, anyhow, cool beans. We're open Friday the 13th and the 14th, and uh, it'll be great. So, what, should we come up with a punchline? Uh, yeah, we'll come up with a punchline later. We don't have a cool punchline to close out, so, uh, yeah. Go home already. What are you still doing here? Weirdo.